And we have another Kittiwake Anchorage, still in Pender Harbor, but we are up in Garden Bay now, only a mile and a half or so from where we were in Garens the last couple of nights, but a slightly different feel. Uh, a bit smaller and uh, we're looking now towards the north and it is not as developed because it's both an Indian reserve and a provincial park access and in fact here is the dinghy dock for the provincial park and uh, so it's it's a bit quieter Heading around now to the east, a bit into the sun, so it'll be silhouetted slightly, but in the far corner in the east side is a Seattle Yacht Club outpost, which is empty at the moment. Well, there's one boat sitting there, but uh, it is uh, not its normal thing because of COVID and entry rules for uh, foreign foreign mariners and now looking southward over to the government wharf at Madeira Park that's the the government wharf that has the most amenities dockage uh, garbage and and recycling uh, showers washrooms that kind of thing now we're looking past the rocks that protect Garden Bay a little bit to the south. Some kayakers working their way across. And then as we look to the, the southwest and west, there are a few houses, some very nice ones, and uh, some, some boats moored. You know, there's that one in front of us with the very nice deck box, which is a, basically an old tin garden shed. It lives here. Uh, but these other ones sitting in front of us are uh, transients just at anchor. And down at the far end is uh, the Garden Bay Members Club, which is a private marina. They do allow some transients if there's space and then immediately to the right of that is surprise for this year the uh, the pub and private marina is all closed up with no trespassing signs everywhere so I guess uh, it might have been a victim of COVID doesn't say it's for sale it's just closed anyway Garden Bay for at least a night We are at the dinghy dock of Garden Bay Provincial Park, Garden Bay Pender Harbor, and we're just getting ready to do a hike up Mount Daniel, which is in the park. It's supposed to be an hour up and an hour down, and it'll probably be the better part of an hour to get to the actual trailhead. We have to walk along. Uh, Garden Bay Road in order to uh, get to the trailhead at the opposite end of the park. So not 100% convenient. Maybe someday they will uh, put a trail up this side of, of the hill. <laughs> 